Yeah. Oh. How much you want for it? Is it five? Both? Five. Six. Six. Huh? Okay. Five. Five. Okay. How much are the shirts? Two. Two? I just take the shirt. Thank you. Okay. You're welcome. You want the uh, thing? Oh, you don't know much? Thank you. Good morning. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Does this uh, DVD thing work? It does work, yeah. Oh. It's really dusty. How much you want for it? You know what, honestly, you can just have that. You sure? Yeah. Right, you don't have the remote for it. I'm not sure many people have a desire for that. Yeah. Now. I'll take it. Just for these, uh, these skate the fires here, okay? Yeah, I see it. I'm blind. I just take this. So I got the uh, the skates, the baseball bat, 
And then uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven hats. Fifteen? Yep. Sounds good to me. Right there. Awesome. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? Good. How are you? Great. How much is this gas can? Three dollars. How much are these? Two per dollar. All right. And then this sometimes you go. But this is. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, thank you. I have my name. I was using a nice can. But I'm doing the whole thing with the, with the chair, the whole, the whole thing. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. Hello, how are you doing? Good, how are you? Doing great, thanks. If you want to put that stuff down, you're welcome. Sure. Okay, uh, thank you, Scott. What did I say, three and one? Three and yeah. one, three yeah. Three and one, so far. So let's go right here. Oh. All right, I'll just take these. Okay. So, what's this? Three, four, five, six, seven. Seven, okay. And I'll get your little bag. Do you change for a 20? Yeah. Okay. 10. 13. Thank you so much. Thank you. Let's have a great, great Thank day. Thank you too. So I just got back from yard selling. Um, didn't go to too many yard sales today because I had a doctor's appointment. So kind of cut into my yard sale. So I was only really yard selling for like an hour and a half. But I did hit 
a few yard sales. And actually the ones that I did go were actually really, really good. So I'm gonna show you exactly what I got. All right, first thing off the bat is this Hugo Boss, um, regular fit uh, button front shirt. Uh, Hugo Boss is not a brand that I really pick up anymore, even at the thrift stores. But uh, this is um, only $2, so it was actually worth the shot. I'm um, not going to get much for this because it's a brand that just kind of, it's a little bit saturated in, in the eBay market right now. So, um, I mean, for two bucks, like I said, it's store filler. So I picked up uh, seven hats from this one yard sale and actually really some really, really good ones. Let me show you exactly what I have here. I got a orange Titleist with the foot joy. This one goes for really good money. These Titleist with the foot joy go for really good money. Um, condition of these hats are average, so I have to clean up some of these. But um, once I do, it should go for pretty decent money. Um, I got a Arizona Diamondbacks, Washington uh, Nationals. I got a Dodgers. I got another Dodger. And I got a another Titleist. This is a uh, Titleist Pro V. Again, this is the Foot Joy. Titleist Foot Joy together will always go for good money. Um, hats and especially shirts. If you see shirts, now the shirts are like, the shirts will be the foot joys and then they'll have the Titleist on somewhere on the sleeve. That goes for really good money. And of course, another Los Angeles Dodger hat. All right, guys, these were a pleasant surprise. These are a pair of uh, women's roller skates. The brand is Roller Derby. Um, I did a quick check on my phone to see if it was worth any money. I saw that they were going for like 60 to $80 used. And these are very good condition. You know, a little bit of wear on the tires. Oop. Sorry. <laughs> a little bit of wear on the tires, but that shouldn't be a problem. Um, once I clean this up, just a little dirty, um, they should go for really good money, 60, 80 bucks. All right, guys, there is a good story behind this uh, pickup right here. As you may have saw in the video, um, the lady that had this uh, BH, um, Sony asked her how much it was. And she actually said, you can, you can just have it because I don't think nobody really want something like this anymore. <laughs> surprise, surprise, they do. Um, these VCR DVD combos go for really good money, um, depending on the brand. This is a Sony, so it's more higher end. Also, another aspect of this is this is one of those uh, DVD recorder things. I think it's, um, yeah, it's called a uh, video cassette recorder, which means I think, I don't know how, but I know they're worth money. But all I know is what happens is you can record like VHS tapes onto DVDs or the DVDs onto VHS tapes. So they record off each other. That's what makes it more valuable. Even if you don't have the remote, this goes for like 70 to hundred dollars um, used, even without the remote. So what I'm gonna do is I'm, I tested it out and it does work, it does power up, it does work. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just clean it up. There's some scratches on here, which I'm gonna do, in, I'm gonna say in the listings. So, but these really go for good money and these sell really, really quick. So I'm very, very happy and lucky that that lady gave this for free. All right, guys, these next two things are from a yard sale that I actually forgot to record. It's actually, this is from a really nice older couple. And um, first thing I got was this tool set, I got a dollar. This is a, um, this, is down here. this is like a, um, it's like a um, thing where you have the bits for like drills and the screwdrivers. Um, I'm actually gonna keep this for myself because I actually need this. So this is something where, you know, yard sales are good to buy stuff and flip on eBay, but it's also a very, very good source to buy stuff super, super cheap and stuff you really, really need for yourself. So I really, really needed this and I'm so glad I got it. And then this thing I got, this was a palm massager, uh, digital therapy. I guess this thing relaxes muscles and relieves muscular spasms or relieve pain. Uh, the lady actually explained how this works. I guess you put it on your body and these like, they have tissues on here and you put it on your body and it kind of eases pain. I don't know. <laughs> All I know is um, I did a quick look on my eBay app and I saw this was going for like 30 to $40 and I got it for five. So this is a pretty, pretty good score something I know nothing about. <laughs> All right, I got this um, Harley Davidson like handkerchief. I usually pick up anything Harley Davidson, shirts, jackets, boots, shoes, you name it. If it says Harley on it, I'm gonna buy it. And this is a handkerchief. This is from the 2007, right here, 2007 Harley Davidson Road Tour. Super nice, like it's never been used. Um, this should really go, this is go for decent money. These Harley Davidson, anything Harley Davidson goes for really good money. Uh, two pen racquetball, pressureless racquetball 
These are brand new. It still hasn't been opened yet. And they actually had four of these, but two of them was open, so I didn't grab, so I didn't take those. I grabbed this. Uh, these were two for a dollar. Um, this is mostly just store filler. I mean, this is brand new. It's Pan, this racquetball. People know that brand as far as racquetball stuff. So it just sell quick. All right, guys, this is something cool I picked up. Um, I usually don't pick up this brand very often, but I just like the design. This is a Chico, Chico shirt. I only picked up because of the design. Look at this golden, look at this like smock looking uh, gold uh, flower um, design. It's just so beautiful. <laughs> I just, I just drew, it just drew to me and I had to get it and it was $2. So even more, but you know, Chico, like I said, is not a brand that I pick up, but you know, if I, if I see it at a yard sale for like a dollar, $2, I will pick it up because this is like an easy, like $15 flip. So, you know, it's easy to, easy to list, easy to store. So, all right guys. And the final thing I picked up is kind of a really, really cool piece. Um, I'm, I've been trying to expand my knowledge as far as stick to stuff to pick up. And this is one of the things I've been trying to pick up old, like, gas canisters old like signs from like the 50s or 60s so i've been watching a lot of youtube videos i um, trying to trying to gain trying to increase my knowledge of stuff like this this is a vintage eagle the gasser um gas uh steel gallon where you store gas anyway this is uh main usa let's see if i can find it here yeah, main the usa right here really really good condition considering it's uh been used quite a bit and it's a little rusty but yeah, i picked it up for three dollars and look at the comps these should go for like 25 to 30 dollars and um super happy with this i'm trying to like expand like i said my knowledge of just different things to resell on ebay and this is one of the things where when i saw it, i said i gotta pick it up even if i don't make money out of this and even if i'm wrong about this i just want to just see if this will sell and see and gain more knowledge of stuff like this so this was three dollars um probably gonna try to uh i don't know how it's gonna ship i guess i gotta make sure there's no gas or nothing in here so still i still got a lot to learn but i'm very very happy with this piece um you know i wish i had an antique booth this would actually go perfect in an antique booth but so that being said i gotta put it on ebay anyways that's gonna be it for this video if you guys like this video please comment like and subscribe uh share it with your friends and i'll see you at the next video for your boy ronnie bizzle garage sale guy have a great day everybody